Alright. Here we go. Diving back in. Um, I think we're, we're on the way to the forest temple. We've got to do all the, all the lead up to it still. We just became big boy Link. There we go. Three spiritual stones. The... What is that? The light medallion. And how many hearts we got? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight hearts. We're doing pretty good. We've got no equipment whatsoever. Time to gear up. Oh, but first we had to go to... They told me to go to the graveyard. In the village. We can, um grab a new piece of equipment that we're going to need to get into the forest temple. I guess we also need to get our horse. I hadn't even thought of that. Let's do this first. We'll do the forest temple. Then we'll come out and then we'll get our horse sorted. I refuse to run around with Deku nuts equipped. It's an embarrassment. Relaxing music. Hey, boys. Hmm. I saw him. I saw the ghostly figure of Dempe the Gravekeeper sinking into his grave. It looked like he was holding some kind of treasure. That's what I want. Give me the treasures. I also need to cash in my gold skull tulas. Because I've got 20 now. So there should be another dude. No, this one. The curse has been broken. Thank you. Here's a reward for you. You obtained the Stone of Agony. If you equip a rumble pack, it will react to nearby secrets. That's cool. That's like holes in the ground and stuff like that. I can bomb or shoot to open. Hello, friend. A long time ago, there was a man in this very village who had an eye they said could see the truth. Now, usually, you have to train your mind's eye most strenuously to actually see the truth. But this fella, no, they say he had a different way of doing things. His house stood where the well is now. That way. Hmm. Graveyard. Right, so where are we going? Gravekeeper's hut. The Gravekeeper's diary is here. Do you want to read it? Yes. Whoever reads this, please enter my grave. I will let you have my stretching, shrinking keepsake. I'm waiting for you. Dempe. Now, which one was his grave? Is it this one? the flowers in front. No, that's a fairy fountain. Do I even need those? No, I am full on fairies. And health. Okay. On to the next grave. that one. There we go. 
Question mark. <laughs> Young man, are you fast on your feet? I may not look like it, but I'm confident in my speed. Let's have a race. Follow me if you dare. Oh, it's this. Jesus. Don't do that. Seven. One oh seven. <laughs> Young man, you are very quick to be able to keep up with me. <laughs> As a reward, I'm going to give you my treasure. It's called the Uckshot. Its spring-loaded chain will pull you to any spot where its hook sticks. Doesn't that sound cool? I'm sure it'll help you. I'll live here now, so come back again sometime and I'll give you something cool. One more thing. Be careful on your way back. Thanks, boss. You got the hook shot. It's a spring loaded chain that you can cast out to hook things. You can use it to drag distant items towards you, or you can use it to pull yourself towards something. While holding C, aim with stick, shoot it by reducing C. Well, that's the best thing. Uh, go away, Deku Nuts. What's Navy want? I wonder what's going on in the forest right now. I'm worried about Saria too. Okay. We're all worried. Um, how do we get out? He did warn me to be careful. I am now trapped. The same design that's on the door of time. Oh, can I remember the song of time? Mm. There we go. And that's our way out. So he was just going to trap me there. If I didn't happen to know this one very specific song. Oh yeah, you're just stuck in there now, friend. Oh, don't fall. Do not fall. There we go. That's the first piece of a fresh new heart. Hello, friend. Grr. Oh, look at that face. Look at that face. I'll never forget what happened on that day seven years ago. Grr. It's all that ocarina kid's fault. Next time he comes around here, I'm gonna mess him up. What the? Oh, like this. What? You've got an ocarina? What the heck? That reminds me of that time seven years ago. Back then, a mean, a mean kid. Came here and played a strange song. It messed up the windmill.
new song. You've learned the Song of Storms. Oh no, a storm again. You played the ocarina again, didn't you? Grrr. Oh, Jesus. I mean, you'd be pretty angry if some stupid little kid came into your house, played a song on, a, on his flute, and fucked up the windmill. You'd be furious. You'd be livid. That's understandable. Sorry, my friend. I meant you no harm. Now, Navi said I should go and check on Saria. Let's go back to the forest. That's a long walk. I should go via Long Long Ranch. Well, what does this say? I need to go to Death Mountain. I need to go to the Lost Woods. I need to go to Zora's Domain. They're the three big ones. Oh, and Kakariko is the uh, other one. But I do want to go to the ranch. See if I can get my horse. Now I'm all grown up. Can't be walking everywhere. I'm not a, I'm not a, I'm not a walking sort of person. See how long this has taken just to get there. Just aim yourself in a straight line, and it still takes like, over a minute of just running in a straight line. Oh, well, let's get there before it gets dark. They won't want to race at night. There we go. Visitor. It's been a long time since we've had a visitor here. Where did you come from? Since Ganondorf came, people in the ta castle town have gone. Places have been ruined, and monsters are wandering everywhere. Mr. Ingo is just using the ranch to gain Ganondorf's favour. Everyone seems to be turning evil. But Dad, he was kicked out of the ranch by Mr. Ingo. If I disobey Mr. Ingo, he'll treat the horses so badly. So there's nothing I can do. That's a bit cruel. That's basically blackmail. Work for me or I'm going to beat the shit out of this horse. Chickens. Nothing in here. Nope. Just climbing all over the cabinets. <laughs> Pop. There are some people in Kakariko spreading rumours that I cheated Talon out of the ranch. Don't be ridiculous. That guy Talon was weak. I, the hard-working Ingo, poured so much energy into this place. I don't want any strangers like you saying anything bad about me. Listen, the great Ganondorf recognised my obvious talents and gave the ranch to me. I will raise a fine horse and win recognition from the great Ganondorf. Say, young man, do you want to ride one of my fine horses? Pay me ten rupees, and you can ride. Do you want to hear how to ride? Sure. I approach the horse quietly and stand by its side. Press A to mount up. Use the stick to make it run. Once it starts running, press A to tap it with the whip, and it'll speed up. When you want to jump over a fence, accelerate and hit it head on. If you try to jump over a fence at an angle, the horse won't like it and won't jump. 
After the horse comes to a complete stop, press A to dismount. Now have fun. Thank you so much. <laughs> in a song. Up, left, right. When you want to dismount, stop and press A. Do I know you? I felt as though I've seen you somewhere before. If you use Z-targeting, you can talk to me from horseback. Are you ready to go home so soon? No, I'm going to carry on riding. I would like to get out of here though. Do you jump the fence? Time's up, young man. You only ten, pay 10 rupees. You played around long enough. Yeah. I don't remember how to get your horse. If that's not it, I don't remember. Okay. Let's get a pony back on track. Let's try it again. Hello, horse friend. I'm sure, you just talk to him. Whoa. You're getting better. How about a little race with me? One lap around the corral with that horse. Let's make a little wager, say 50 rupees. Oh my god. No chance. Destroyed. We're gaming. Wah. Shoot! If the great Ganondorf fans out about this humiliation... Hey you, how about another race? If you win... You can keep the horse! Why would you say that? Oh, he's not messing about this time. Ready? I've got to take him on the inside. Gone wide. I've got to save my carrots for the last stretch. Oh, destroyed Ingo, you stupid fuck. My horse now. What's up with that horse? Is that a pony? 
How did you tame that wild horse right under my nose? I was going to present that horse to the great Ganondorf, but I bet it on the race and lost. Shoot. Oh. As I promised, I'll give the horse to you. However, I'll never let you leave this ranch. What are you going to do? Just leave me here to, like, starve to death on this corral? Never gonna work, was it? Okay. We have a horse. We have a hook shot. Is now the time to head back to the forest? It could be. We can make a start on the forest temple. Should I wait till it's daytime? I suppose I might get some gold skull tullers if I wait till night. If I leave it at night. Let's try it anyway. in my house. That's right, I'm gonna get killed. Oh, come on, get off. I am very big. We could go and say hi to the Deku tree. Ouch. Okay, no sneaking. bit of swordsmanship now. Boom. Oh, the Deku tree's actually sealed up. Guess we won't go in there then. So I suppose. Oh my lord, they've respawned already. That leaves the, the lost woods. Hearts.
whatever. I'll get some hearts. Attack me. Wow, it's a big rupee. Sleeping. Hmm. What's this? Can I use my hook shot? So no. No. Okay. It's back. Sean. I'm just going to get myself killed by accident on the way to the, to the uh, forest temple. And we can't have that now, can we? Also, yeah. This is... nothing. What's this got? One rupee or something. Five rupees. I was five times wrong. What are you? Though you wear Kokirish clothing, you can't fool me. I promised Saria I would never let anybody go through here. Hmm. Music? Okay. That melody. Saria plays that song all the time. Do you know Saria? That song. Saria taught that song only to her friends. Okay, I trust you. When I see you, I don't know why, but I remember him. Because I am him, you fucking dumbo. Um, I don't think this is the way, but... Oh, is this somewhere I should have planted a seed as a child to get on top of the tree or something? Oh no. Whatever. We'll come back here later. I think it's this way. It's changed. rumbling. There's a hole. What is this? Oh, 
Wow, I don't remember this place at all. It's kind of freaky. I love it. Rupees, fine. I love this texture. Look at that. How out of place is that? That looks broken. With a stone roof that doesn't even line up with the walls. How weird. From here on, we'll be going through some narrow passages. If you take it slow, maybe you can sneak up on some enemies. Use Z-targeting to always look in the proper direction. Set your view so you can see down the next corridor before you turn the corner. Once your view is set, hold down Z to sidestep around the corner. That way you won't be surprised by an enemy waiting in ambush. Like this boy. <laughs> I got got good. Thank you. Scarecrow point. Let's see if this is the right place to play it. Hmm. Maybe it's from over this side. do something to activate it as adult link no, I haven't done that yet I've definitely set the song as as a kid there's probably something to do as an adult to turn it on Ooh. Mm. 
Jesus. Hmm. How do we get past this? Bombs? Not very tidy, but I'll take it. She's gone. Where is she? Bitch. Ah, Sheikah. flow of time is always cruel. Its speed seems different for each person, but no one can change it. A thing that doesn't change with time is a memory of younger days. In order to come back here again, play the Minuet of Forest. See you again. Small key. I love that old link scream. It's so cool. Ghosties. Okay. Forest Temple. Off we go.
fully equipped. I've got a small key, and that's a small key door. Let's start there, I suppose. painted on the floor. Okay. go around the loop again. Come at it from the side. in a hole which I can't get to yet I can jump across but there's no way up as of yet there is a an eyeball thing okay this might be a puzzle for later let's go back down and then we'll go upwards there's nothing behind here. Nothing behind here. Okay. Oh, that's the block. Is that the block? Yeah, I pushed it down, didn't I? Oh, I see. And now I can shove it all the way out. Following those arrows. And I suppose that's our route onwards. get through here. If I jump the gun back. Okay, so I can come back through here and there's at least two eyeball things I can shoot that'll open up stuff. Very well. Whoa. That's a big drop. Right. I did use my small key to get in there, but I don't need that. They couldn't soft lock you because you didn't find the key, surely. 
or if you spent the key on the wrong door, you're buggered. Another one of these. Um, some of time. No, I do not remember the song of time. Um, right, A down. No, right, A down. Right, A down. God, I hate these N64 controls on a Switch Pro. They're terrible. Yeah, I meant that. Hmm. What do we have? A little island. Some vines. There's our way up. And there's also... A little thing to go down here. Yeah. It's full of water. Let's go up first. No, oh, that's literally it. That's. Can't. Look onto the vines. No. Okay. Got some hearts. Unless there's anything under the the river, no. Vision is based on movement. Chest animation. It's a dungeon map. No, the wrong way. Target. Can we hook ourselves over there? We can. This isn't the same area I was in a minute ago. This is somewhere that looks very similar. And that's unflooded. So. See if we can grapple that chest. You should be able to do that. That looks doable. Maybe I'm just too low. There we go.
Yeah, I must have to activate that. That's definitely a scarecrow point. Oh, wonderful. Thank you. So I've got through here is one way, and I've got under here. Underneath the well. Small key. I don't remember what was up here. Well, I did need another small key, didn't I? So, I came in through that door. I've now explored that side. Let's go back through and try that door on the other side. See if there's anything I can I can do through there. If not, we can head back to the main room and we've got the small key to use on that door. And that was in the room on the first left as you came in. That's not a nice big loop. Okay. So, I want this room, I think. This was originally locked, wasn't it, with a something? No, that's not right. That's not right at all. Ah, uh, that's the front door there, so the first left is up here. Just ignore those for now. No need to chase them down. Twisty corridor. This corridor is all twisted. No oh, shit. Listen. Watch for the shadows of monsters. Monsters? Monsters that hang from the ceiling. Today. Is there a chest or a door or anything? No? Another dead end. So you need three small keys to get through this area. And the bow and arrow to deal with the twistiness. Hmm. Okay, well. Gonna make that jump. 
No, es que no. left them. So, that's the first exit. That was the second exit I think I've cleared out. We've got that door straight ahead, which looks open. That's closed, but that was a roundabout journey, and that's nothing. So there's only one way for me to go, really, and that's straight ahead. Hopefully that leads to a key or the bow. I forget which, which order they come in. Spider, then. Is it on this side? There he is. This guy's back. Everyone's played Dark Souls these days. Just block and wait your turn in the recovery animation. Easy. Easy peasy. Is that a small key? That's the small key. That's the third key I'm after. So now we can go down Twisty Corridor. And that should hopefully let me progress. Um. What did we say? First entrance, so this one. Kind of set it up so there's a lot of backtracking. This is actually quite a small space I've worked in so far, and I'm probably halfway through the dungeon by now. I'm, oh, I haven't actually been very far or done very much. Just lots of get a key, key in the door. Need another key, key in the door. One last key. Hey Navi, this is a twisted corridor. I don't know if you noticed that. Okay. Oh, and these are the uh, ghosty pictures. <laughs> Did you see that sprite fold up like something out of Who Framed Roger Rabbit? Boom. More? 
too. chest. I will take that nut. I'm always taking nut. The fairy bow. Set it to C on the subscreen. C to take it out and hold it. As you hold down C, aim with the stick, release to let fly with an arrow. Boom. I love the bow. Lots of fun. Where did I come from? This way. So what's that way? Oh, it's the other side. Okay, okay, okay. Thanks for the arrows. So am I just... around a range it's no bother lights are on chest is here I presume that's the compass. That's the only thing I don't really have yet. Compass. Now I can see where on earth I'm going. Um, let's go back. Quickly do that other one. Just so it's done, and then I can explore. I can push on and explore a bit. Because I don't remember what's next. Oh, there's a chest there, apparently. Oh, it hasn't appeared yet. Right, I've got to shoot the pictures. No. Here we 
go. Invisible chest. Hopefully it's... What do I need? Like a small key or something? Mm -hmm. Right, now we can push on. Both the lights are on. And I think that lights the two corresponding lights up in the, the starting room. So I've got to find two more of those. Where they are, I do not remember. But now I've got the bow, I can go back and shoot those two eyeballs that were in the first area. That will hopefully let me push on a little further. Watch for shadows, monsters on the ceiling. Let's get off of here. Deal with that real quickly. Hmm, what have we got up here? I suppose. Well, this corridor is all straight. Yeah, when you look back at the design of these dungeons, they're not great. They're very, uh, I suppose exploitative is the wrong word, but they don't, they don't like respect your time. There's a lot of backtracking. Maybe that's just modern game design's a bit soft around the edges, whereas this was designed to be kind of harsh, but it, I don't like it. Yeah. Okay, so we've got those two eyeballs to go and shoot one. We can untwist the corridor, and that will make something else accessible. Uh, there was a boss key on the ceiling, so I can go and grab that. Oh no, he's going to jump down, isn't he? Let's get out of here before he, before he becomes a problem. So I can untwist that corridor, grab that key. That's an easy one. Give me your nuts. change how I get out of the room, or can I get out of the room? Oh, there's a hole. Maybe I don't want to drop down there just yet. Yeah, boss key. Got it. Jesus. I whiffed that. Well, let's... Let's go and explore. Stand still! We can get out though. Oh, that just puts you up here. I see. How about you just die? Dare I go for a heart? No, not currently. It's not that important. Nothing hidden. No? Okay. 
Door A or door B? Door A. My small king. Oh, that puts you here, okay. Well. It's awfully convenient. Now I can open that other eyeball that needed to be shot. And then I can push on through to the second twisty corridor. Um, and retwist it. I think, yeah, the first the first one needs retwisting. And then the second one wants retwisting. Um, where was that eyeball? Is it above me? Do I have to go up a level? Oh no, it was in here, isn't it? It's over this way. There it is. Just a chest. Stock up of arrows. That's fine. Nothing vital to the, the mission. Just roll down here. I'd love to roll down here. I would love to roll down here. I, I would love to roll down here. A to go down. A to go down. Thank you. Good lord. <laughs> oh, please. Game. Don't show me up. Right. twist the corridor, because that opens the pathway to the side, and then we can push on. Now we've got this extra small key, we can go through here. Yeah, and I won't be doing anything to this corridor. I'm just going through because the other end was locked with the small key door. So we're just pushing on. There's no twisting just yet. Maybe on the way back. But I've got everything I need. I've got the bow and arrow. I've got the boss key. All I'm doing is just pushing on. Can we make it? you and that's going to be done by shooting through this fire until it lines up roughly with that Ooh, no don't play the flute um, where was the door I store Oh, that wasn't a door. There's only one way in, one way out. What do I do in here then? I 
I didn't see. Did that? Oh, did that retwist the corridor? So now when I come out. Should be another access through here somewhere. Through the hole in the floor? Or through that door? Oh no, not this way. It must be the hole in the floor. Oh, the crushing ceiling! Oh my goodness. What's up here? Oh, this is over here. So this is how you make the shortcut. When you eventually... Let's try it one more time. Yeah, I haven't activated it. We'll go to Lake Hillier after this and see if we can turn that on. Because that unlocks some more secrets. There's lots of them hidden throughout the world and they let you hook shot and long shot to various points. Link, watch out! The ceiling's fallen down! No shit. It's literally two inches away from my face. Okay. So we're going to push straight for the switch after this. That opens up the door. Oh, they block first person. Okay, that's annoying. So there's a spider in the near one, but I can make a break for that chest and go to the square just to the left of it. That should also be safe. Ready? Go. And I guess I can open the chest while I'm here. Arrows. And now we're just going to the door. Nice and straightforward. Hello. So this is a puzzle game. Again. Put together this puzzle of her face. Fifteen seconds to spare. No, oh, and then I've got to beat you. This is Amy, one of the Poe sisters, named for when she appears. I'm never sure if this is the right way to do it, but it's. Very straightforward. Or if I should be like clanging her off my shield and then attacking. Yeah, this seems the lo the most risk free. Not that it's very difficult to begin with, but you don't need to make artificial difficulty for yourself if there is none. Not in a game like this, it's pretty easy overall. I think this might be one of the easier Zeldas, the Ocarina of Time. There's no challenge at all in anything. There is just no risk of death throughout this entire game, really. Especially if you've played it before and you've got like a, a very, like I have, like a very broad knowledge of what's coming up. You don't know specifics, but you you roughly know what there is. Oh, it's this guy. Hello. Hello. 
purple ghost. It's four of you. Almost immediately, which one's gonna spin? You. Ba -ba -da -ba -ba. Why is all the music in this game so good? Like everything, every mu bit of music, every little. Jingle when you open a door or get a key or beat a boss, it's all just absolute classic. And that's Poe number four. Yep. I think that's all I need. Let's uh let's jump in. Oh yeah, this annoying room. What have we got? One door with a boss behind it, and one with a switch. Let's give it a shove. Yeah, we got a switch. And... nothing. Nothing, nothing. Okay. So I was pushing it clockwise. No, anti-clockwise. So we'll keep going anti-clockwise so we get to see everything. Still, nothing at all. And that's another switch. Okay. What do we have? Nothing. Spider. Is this a heart? More arrows. Another gold spider brings me to a, a whopping total. 25? Was that all of them in the dungeon? Don't you get a mark on your map when you've got them all? Hmm. Maybe it is. Maybe it's on the world map. Dunno. Or maybe I haven't got them all. That's the other, <laughs> the other answer. Yeah, I'm not going to go back and get all the spiders. I genuinely don't even know what you get for getting all the spiders. Oh, I love this creepy music. It's so good. Boss time. This is one of my favourite bosses in this whole game. It's absolutely great. I love it. It's so creepy and weird. Menacing as well, just the way you're trapped. And he's laughing at you. <laughs> oh. Oh. Evil spirit from beyond the Phantom Ganon. So good. This is so good. I love this boss. It's 
So there's two of them, you've got to shoot the right one. Oh, Jesus. I've just been lucky so far. There's one. Ouch. Right, let's get some distance. I'm too close. Phantom Ganon is an evil ghost of the Forest Temple. He comes out of one of the pictures. Answer his magic attack with an attack of your own. There's also the uh, the foreshadowing for the last boss fight as well, which is which draws a lot from this fight. Oh my lord, how fast is that going? Come on, get away. Oh. That's it, stay over there. Give me lots of room to play with. Easy. Just chop you to death. Bum, 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 bum. Hey kid, you did quite well. It looks like you may be gaining some slight skill. But you have defeated only my phantom. When you fight the real me, it won't be so easy. What a worthless creation that ghost was. I will banish it to the gap between dimensions. Oh. Shit. Sorry. <laughs> Nothing. Nothing against you, ghosty man. If it was a ghost, that means it was once a living thing. I've just banished someone to the fucking shadow realm that I have no idea who they are. There we go, that's heart number nine. Oh, thank you. I am Saria, the Sage of the Forest Temple. I always believed that you would come, because I knew you. No. You don't have to explain it to me, because it is destiny that you and I can't live in the same world. What? I will stay here as the Forest Sage and help you. Now please, take this medallion. Bum, bum, bum. <laughs> you receive the forest medallion. Saria awakens as a sage and adds her powers to yours. Or powers. I am the power. Saria will always be your friend. Oh, How sweet. Oh. The fuck is that? Ah! 
Hi there, I'm the Deku Tree Sprout. Because you and Saria broke the curse on the, the forest temple, I can grow and flourish. Hey, Brosus. Phantom Ganem is amazing. It is like Babington. Have you seen your old friends? None of them recognized you with your grown-up body, did they? That's because the Kokiri never ever grow up. Even after seven years, they're still kids. You must be wondering why only you have grown up. Well, as you might have already guessed, you're not a Kokiri. You're actually a Hillian. And I'm finally happy to have revealed this secret to you. This dopey little tree man. Oh, serious cutscenes. Some time ago, before the King of Hyrule finished this country, there was a fierce war in our world. One day, to escape the fires of the war, a Hillian mother and her baby boy entered this forbidden forest. The mother was gravely injured. Her only choice was to entrust the child to the Deku Tree, the guardian spirit of the forest. The Deku Tree could sense this was a child of destiny whose fate would affect the entire world, so he took him into the forest. After the mother passed away, the baby was raised as a Kokiri, and now finally the day of destiny has come. Do we know who Link's mother is? I certainly don't. I have no idea. You are a Hillian, and are always bound to leave this forest. And now, you have learned your own destiny, so you know what you must do. That's right, you must save the land of Hyrule. Now Link, break the curses on all the temples, and return peace to Hyrule. I love that this, like, five second old scrub is delivering this incredibly serious lore. I'm the Deku Tree Sprout. Because you and Saria broke the curse on the forest temple, I can grow and flourish. Thanks a lot. You're welcome. Okay. Onwards and upwards. What's after the forest temple? I'm assuming the... F I think it's the fire temple. Well, we've got the choices. Let's do fire. I think that's the order it goes in. It's been too long since I played this game. Ah, oh, Navi. Save me. There we go. That cloud over Death Mountain. There's something strange about it. Yeah. Hello. Now that the Deku Tree Sprout is growing in the Great Tree Deku Tree's meadow, the forest has returned to normal. God, look at that draw distance. That's pretty bad. <laughs> Link, I wonder if he will come back. Mm, yeah, I wonder. Hey! A boner. Death Mountain, then. So I suppose that's through... That's through the village. doesn't like stairs. Okay. Noted. Gekariko Village. Oh, chill music. Hmm. They finished building these buildings. Let's... Investigate. That's a that's a mini game, I think. Yeah, let's do it. Let's do it. Who's this man? Hello. 
What a face. That's a face for radio. 20 rupees? Sure. This is a game for grown-ups. Hyrule's famous shooting gallery. Take aim at the targets from that platform over there. Can you hit 10 targets? You get 15 shots. Draw your weapon with B. Are you ready? Go for a perfect score. Oh, Jesus. Look at that! First time! Here's a fantastic present. 40 arrows. Fine, I'll take it. Did you get anything else? Mm. Well, I'm not going to do it again. Once is enough. Okay. Death Mountain, this way. Can't believe I just did that first try. That took me about six tries as a kid. Here we go. Potion shop. What's that? Item shop. What's that? Arrows, sticks? Nah, don't need none of that. Load of our rubbish. How many is that now? 26. We're going to dodge the boulders. We're going to dodge the boulders. I think I need to go back into Dongo's cavern. Going in the city? I suppose we should really. Let's go and see what Darunia. Oh, yes. I should have just left that equipped. I'll take it. Controllers vibrating. Oh. Why is my controller vibrating then? check later. Okay. What's occurring? In Goron City. Oh, it's the little dude. Are we going to stop him from rolling with some bombs like last time? Oh, I picked that up far too early. <laughs> That's never going to make it. into it. Oh. I'll use my bombs because they've got a shorter fuse, even though I've only got nine. We can do the same thing, but I won't have to 
time it quite so well. I can kind of bait him into it. He says. Hmm. Oh, please. Game. Don't, don't do me like this. There we go. Yeah. How could you do this to me? Your Ganondorf servant. Hear my name and tremble. I'm Link. No, you're not. Here are the Gorons. How can you be Link with a, a cute face like that? What? Your name's also Link. Then you must be the legendary Dodongo Buster and hero, Link. My dad is Darunya. Do you remember him? Dad named me Link after you because you're so brave. Oh, what a nice man. It's a cool name. I really like it. Link, you're a hero to us Gorons. I'm so glad to meet you. Please give me your autograph. Sign it to my friend, Link of the Gorons. Oh, I guess it's not a good time to ask you for this. Please help everyone. My dad Darunia went to the fire temple. A dragon is inside. If we don't hurry up, even my dad will be eaten by the dragon. Boo hoo. You better try to calm him down if you can. Maybe he'll calm down if you talk to him. What do you want to ask him? Tell me about the Gorons. Tell me about the dragon. A long time ago, there was an evil dragon named Volvagaya. Volvagia? Volvagia? I don't know. Volvagaya. That sounds less genitalia-like. Living in this mountain. That dragon was very scary. He ate Gorons. Using a huge hammer, the hero of the Gorons, boom, destroyed it, just like that. This is a myth from long ago, but it is true. I know because my dad is a descendant of the hero. Boo-hoo. Now tell me about the Gorons. Everybody was taken to the fire temple. While my dad was out, Ganondorf's followers came and took them all away. All of them will be eaten by Volvagaya. Dad said that Ganondorf has revolved Volvagaya as a warning to those who might oppose him. Ganondorf's going to feed them all to Volvagaya. Dad went to the fire temple all by himself to try to save everybody. Please help, Link. I'll give you this heat-resistant tunic. Ah, I was wondering where that came from. A Goron tunic. It's heat-resistant, adult size. Going to a hot place? Don't worry. That's awfully convenient. I hear a spider. I see a spider. Can we get it from here? Maybe? Or is that too far? Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Hmm. Let's try an arrow. And then we can just... Bounce over there and grab it. Over there. Oh, maybe I can't grab it. Well, we'll see. Can you climb on that? No. Alright, let's... Can we drop off? There it is. Look at that. Parkour. Okay. Oh right, he's not here. He's gone to the temple to try and rescue everyone. Can we move this? Yeah, we can. Old looking Goron thing. Oh, it's hot. I need to put on my um, new outfit. The drip. Look at that. Looks great. Love it. Timeless. What's up here? Ok, 
can I blow those up? They look like they can be blown up. I'm running out of bombs rapidly. No, they can't. What is that? is out, but I think we can, yeah, hook shot our way across, ah, chic, chic a -deek. It is something that grows over time, a true friendship, a feeling in the heart that becomes stronger even over time. The passion of friendship will soon blossom into a righteous power, and through it you will know which way to go. This song is dedicated to the power of the heart. Listen to the Bolero of Fire. Down A, down A, right down, right down. So fiddly with this switch controller. Said it about ten times. I'm gonna say it every time. It's cuts. It's like a music video. You have learned the Bolero of Fire. I'll see you again, Link. Ninja smoke bomb. I'm out. Okay. What do we got? That's. I think that's where you teleport him. Oh, there's all these little secret areas off to the side as well. Let's jump in. I'm just going to dive straight in. Oh, nearly. Temple. Okay. Okay. Hello, boss. Please don't eat me. If you eat something like me, you'll get a stomach ache. You'll be sorry. There's the boss key right away. Oops. I hope there's no other items I needed. I didn't really spend much time on the world map this time. That's kind of nothing. Oh, hello. Is that you, Link? Oh, it really is, Link. You've grown so big since I last saw you. I wanted to have a man-to-man -man talk with you, but now's not the time. Ganondorf is causing trouble on Death Mountain again. He has revived the evil ancient dragon, Volvagaya. On top of that, he's going to feed my people to that evil dragon, as a warning to other races that might resist him. If that fire-breathing dragon escapes from the mountain, all of Hyrule will become a burning wasteland. I'll go on ahead to try and seal up the evil dragon. I'm concerned, though, because I don't have the legendary hammer, but I have no choice. Link, I'm asking you to do this as my sworn brother. While I'm trying to deal with the dragon, please save my people. The prisoner's cells are in the opposite direction. I'm counting on you, Link. Okay. 
You didn't have to lock the door behind yourself, though. That's, that doesn't seem too smart. Fine. Okay. Hey. It's the boy. Are you releasing me? Am I free to go? I'll tell you a secret for saving me. In order to get into the room where Darinia went, you have to do something about the pillar stuck in the ceiling. Find a path that leads to a room above the ceiling right away. Hmm. Okay. And... A small key. I'll take it. The pillar stuck in the ceiling. Oh, that one. So that's got to drop down and that's, that's my path into the boss door. So that'll be the last thing I do. Oh shit! No, okay. Note to self. You cannot make that jump. I suppose that would defeat the purpose of having a pillar to... Yeah. Um, I guess we want to go explore everywhere. Still good on fairies? We're still good on fairies. Well, you can go free. Let's go and use this small key opposite on the opposite side. I seem to remember this dungeon being very confusing. And I got very turned around back in the day. Bear in mind that was 20 years ago. It doesn't look any less confusing today. So that's a song of time block. We can get rid of that. Can't go through there. And there might be something over there. Maybe. That looks like a blank door, but we'll see. Let's try that side first. That's that's a positive route. And they're generally pretty fair about holding your hand through these dungeons. They'll they will lead you in the right direction but let you get lost if you decide to veer off. Nope. It's the boy number two. I am releasing you. You are free to go. And here's a secret. A wall that you can destroy with a Goron's special crop will sound different than a regular wall if you hit it with your sword. Right, so bombable walls... You can hit with your sword and they, they all sound different. Okay. Good to know. That's my small key. So I can go out the, the straight ahead door in this, this big room. But... What's this then? Can I summon it down? down, nearly on top of my own head. Okay. I remember these. And straightforward, and now I've got to deal with this thing. No, nope, that ain't how you do it. Oh, is it? Or is it? <laughs> no. I think they eat your stuff. They eat your shields and armor and things, don't they? Okay. Nothing else in here? It's just a little treasure room. Okay. Understood. So 
we've got the small key so we can head to the opposite side, or I can go and check that blank door and see if that's bombable. They wouldn't have mentioned it in a oh, 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 in a in a text box if or in a the secret from the Goron. If it wasn't important. Let's check it out. Yeah. Um let's wait for that to come back. And then jump off. Oh no skulls. tell you a secret. There are switches in this temple that you have to cut to activate, but you can also use the Goron special crop to do the job. Hmm. Okay. Another key. That complicates things maybe. Head up the door then. Um, can we just climb on these? Yes, we can. Can we just. Yes, we can. Oh, thank you. How annoying. Hearts up there. Let's go. Let's go up before we go in. I can at least top up my hearts. Double. Two in one. Look at that. That'd be even that'd be really impressive for a minute. <laughs> Two there as well. So I presume I've got to push that block onto the fire spout. zero keys. There's boy number four. Can't get to him yet though. And you come in from the other side it looks like, so I've got to work my way around. Okay. Switch I can use the, the special crop on. Well, that's. Whoosh. I presume that's got to go. Oh, maybe you don't push it off. 
Oh no, you, you have to. I can't climb it. It's too tall. I thought I might have to climb up. Okay, so we can come back a space. What's the plan here? See, the switch is there, and I've just got to trigger it from up here. Got to shoot it rather than bomb it. Oh, or is that not going to leave me enough time to climb? I see. That makes sense. So, instead, let's face the camera the right way. We'll get right up on the edge. And then... I'm right there. Oh, just made it. How high do those flames go? Pretty high. Okay. Onwards. boy. Okay. We can deal with this like an ordinary maze and stick to one wall. If we just follow the outside, so we can explore all the corners. Hmm. Thank you. Literally in my face. <laughs> boy. Your boy number four. Yep, releasing free to go. A secret. As a reward. When you're on fire, you can put it out by swinging your sword or rolling forward. Did you know that? I didn't know that actually. I knew you could swing your sword. I knew you could roll. I didn't know you could swing your sword. That's good to know. So if a boss sets you on fire, just keep on slashing. Understood. Always be slashing. ABS. Okay. That's a mini... That's a mini key. A small key door. But there must be some more stuff in this dungeon. Oh shit. up here? No. Ouch. There is a boy up there. Okay. One switch. Yeah, it's boy number five. Hello. You are free. Thanks for the secret. In this temple, there are doors that fall down when you try to open them. When one of these doors starts to fall, move. If you use a, a sample of the Goron special crop, you can break it. Fake doors. Mimic doors. Oh no. I'd forgotten about those. Okay, well, let's carry on. Carry on clockwise. I must be almost back to the start. Stick by. Yeah. Yeah, that's the start. Okay, so we've done a we've done a full lap. So all I've skipped so far is that one small key door, and um, if there's anything in the center, which I don't think there is. Well, let's try this door anyway. Oh shit! Anything in here? It's a big room. There are no enemies though. Um, Shoot it. Is it on a timer? It is not. I will take the hearts. 
I shouldn't have taken them all. Never mind. And we'll use our other key here. Okay. Hmm. Let's check that other door. Oh, and this is... Oh, this is just an item. Okay. Phew. Ba -ba 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 it's a dungeon map. Okay. Oh, but the dungeon map is so useless without the, the compass. I've just got no sense of direction in these places. It's all visual cues rather than map. Okay. Let's go. Camera, don't fail me now. Oh shit. That's not good. Oh no, it's faster than I thought. Oh, it's almost on my ass. I don't even have a key for that door anyway. So I need to come back through here with a small key. Oh, that's just rollers. Okay, okay. That makes sense. I hear Goron voices down below. Oh, this is a, a bombable thing. Okay. It did look weird. I did recognise that. Cool. Anyway, back up, or am I going all the way down? Yes, there is. There's a big way down. Okay, drop it and catch it. No. Oh, this is him. This is the boy from earlier. So this makes this boy number five? Six? I'm losing track. You're released. You're free. Thanks for the tip. Somewhere in this temple, you're sure to meet up with some creatures that dance as they attack. Arrows won't hurt them. Looks like you might need some of the Goron's special crop. I'm seeing a recurring theme for this dungeon. Don't jump in the fire, blow it up with bombs. Congratulations, that's 90% of this dungeon. They're still so fun, they're so well designed, these dungeons. Like, I haven't played this game since 98, 98, 99, and I'm just cruising through this amazing design, gorgeous music. The controls are a bit bleh, but, you know, that's the controller's fault, I think. Oh, don't do it. Don't do it. <laughs> Not really using magic yet, either. A non issue so far. Oh, that's him over there. I couldn't even see him, the draw distance is so bad. like a waste of arrows, but what can you do? I'm not going to risk getting knocked down again. It's you, it's the boy, six or seven. Are you releasing me? Am I free to go? I think you're six. I'll tell you a secret. 
If you find a place that you can see on the map but can't reach, try playing your ocarina. Well, I have done that already, so that's... Okay. Two keys. And there was that one key door back in the room with the chasing fire. So we'll head to there. Um, we'll have to go over here, aren't we? Over the skinny bit. Oh, there's a thing up there, a scarecrow one. I don't have that unlocked yet. I need to go and do that. I said that in the last dungeon. I still didn't do it. I'll do it after this one, because we're going to the lake anyway. So That should work out well. How do you get on top of those? Hmm. Might be able to jump on that far one. I hope I can, because there's no way off now. So. Is this going to pass me? There we go. How does one get over there? Is that a run and a jump? That is just a run and a jump. Oh, Jesus. Jesus, Jiminy Cricket. What's that? You can see down from here. Isn't that the room where we saw Darinia? Oh, so that's the... Thinking. Please don't attack me. So that's the pillar. And I've got to knock down. Just got to figure out... Do I hit it with a hammer or a bomb or... Some combination of those two. So we can go that direction, or that direction. Oh, there's a switch over this way, so let's give that a try. Oh, and these all pop up as well. Oh dear, oh dear. Oh, and there's monsters. Oh, there's a door. Didn't even see it. Is this going to be the compass? Compass! Doo -doo -doo -doo. I toggled my map off, I hadn't even noticed. Oh Jesus. Okay, which way are we going? No, no, no. I don't like this room. So we're not going that way. That is off limits. I can get through there. Through there. Are you kidding me? Eat special crop. You fucker. I hear a bat as well. <gasps> There's a hole in the floor. Do not fall in the hole. It's only a little hole. Okay. We love a small hole. Um, another door. That looks fake because it's on the wall. I'm gonna bomb it. Stay calm. Don't rage. I've got a key. I've just got to find a way across. Flashing green there. Oh. Hmm. 
Is there something I can do? Oh, this is the other side, so now I'm past that wall I couldn't get past before. Excellent. Amazing. Graceful. Do not do that to me. Please do not kill me. Do a little bit of trial and error, so we go out of here, and it's just straight up, round and across. That's not bad. I'll just uh, try that one again. That was just practice. Yeah, that was a good test run. Go, 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 go. Bombs and hearts. Bombs and hearts. Nothing else to do. Onwards. Oh. Excuse me. That's just mean. That's a door. It's a door with a face you can trust. Or weapons. Oh, is this the dancing guy? Is going to be the end of me. I remember this dude. He's nice and easy. I think you fight another one later. Or a very similar enemy, anyway. Okay. A lift. Going up. Going out. Okay. It's a switch. What does that do? It drops the fire up there. This is another bomb situation, I'll take it. Yeah. I like those timing based puzzles. You have to think a little bit about it. Oh no. What I don't like is big pits. That will probably throw you down to the starting room if I fall. That will make me very unhappy. What enemies have we got? Let's shoot down everything possible. Dude over there. That would be a hell of a snipe if I can get him. Let's try it. One shot. Not even close. Cool. Absolutely terrible. Cool. 
What's that? That's nothing. Okay. Hmm. Oh, that's timed. Well. Phew. So this must be the hammer. This must be the hammer. Do 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 do. Megaton hammer. Smash junk. It's heavy. You need two hands to swing it. Okay. Um. Sorry, arrows. No, we'll, we'll keep the arrows. We'll get rid of the hook shot. We don't use that much. So there's no blocking. I like that. Link squats. Alright, so. Oh, this is just the route back, okay. Nope, not today. Not ever. Yeah, that's incredibly annoying space. And I guess you have to whack that with the hammer. Okay. We're just jumping down. Oh. Uh, okay. Nice and slow. Drop it. Where are we? You. Gone. Ah, they're the same as the ones at the start, so I need to go back to the first room and clear that thing out of the way. Give me boxes, so I won't smash them just yet. They might be used for something. Do you hit that? You do hit that. Yeah, there's a button down there. That might need something left on it. There we go. So we're back in this room. This switch looks rusted. Well, I'll fucking smack it then. So we do everything in this game. Is that the big pillar? Can I? Oh yeah, that's the pillar. Well, let's deal with this situation up here first. Across. What use is that though? Oh, you can use it to get across to that side as well. Okay. Got it. Rusty switch. Let's release bro number seven. Hello. You are released. You are free to go. Thank you for the secret. A door is hidden inside the statue at the entrance to this temple. I already figured that out. And the Goron special crop won't work on it. 
don't you have anything stronger? So this hammer is stronger than a bomb. It's literally an explosive hammer. Jesus. The force you must swing this thing with. Link's got arms like a nuclear bomb. Okay. Now I need to think. Where are we going? Because we're kind of on a loop back to the start at this stage. Because from here I can drop down back towards the beginning. I don't know if that's the right thing to do. I guess it might be. Am I on the right side though? Oh, I was on the right side before. Okay. did that. This is a heart there. I've got to navigate back through here. And then I guess it's down here. Oh, I don't have the boss key yet, do I? Hmm. Oh, I hope I didn't need to be back up there. Well. We'll be walking back up if we do. Never mind. Oops. This had a hammer door. Magics those blocks away. That's pretty cool. Okay, small key. This is a room full of baddies. arrows. Let's throw a bomb at them or something. Well, they don't give a shit about bombs. Oh, yes, they do. Can I just stab them? I can. What way Overcomplicating that, as usual. Nothing else in this room? No. I remember these. Nice and easy, as long as you're ready for them. And then, Jelly Boy, he enjoys a bomb. pretty well before. Oh, 
Oh no. No 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 no. like a good little jelly bean. It's just a little key. Some bombs. Um, that's where I came from. Let's try this way. And it's the boy from the very start. But, uh, Rusty switch. I'll take the key first. Do 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 do, boss key. Get inside the chamber where the boss lurks. Are you releasing me? Am I free to go? I see. Big brother Darunia asks you to rescue me. I owe you big time. Please help, big bro. I'll help big bro. He's my bro. He's my, my sacred sworn bro. Darunia the Swole. Okay, let's see if there's any pots I can break to get some hearts. I might have to kill some of these as well. Because I think it's boss time now. I don't think there's anything left to do. This side, I think. Yeah, this is it. I don't remember. I remember it's a dragon, and I remember there's a. You can kind of cheese it by hanging off the edge. <laughs> but other than that, I don't remember much else about what to do. Bright red light. Subterranean lava dragon. Volvagaya. Them eyes. It's pretty cool. Not quite as good as Phantom Gen, but pretty cool. Okay, we're gonna hammer him. Kind of dangle off the side, and I don't think he gets you. I think you can avoid all the shit he shoots at you. Okay. Show yourself. Just hang out on the side for a second. There we are, that's what you're avoiding, all of that shit. I don't think it can hit you if you're hanging off here. It's some amount of immunity. Hammers. Jesus, that doesn't stop. I'm just going to wait on the side here, my man. You do your thing. Hammer. 
link like a fucking stone cold killer just running around with a 50 ton hammer that hits like a nuclear bomb okay it's up in the air again I'm just gonna creep off of that That's what I was trying to avoid. Ouch. Ooh, almost dead. It's quick. Let's just take it safe. I've got three fairies, so I'm never going to die. Hammer out. Link's out of breath. One, two, three, four. There we go. Phew. I did say I was never going to die, and this game was easy, and then we died. <laughs> Jesus, he's loud. Teeny tiny touch. There we go. Give me that heart. What's that? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Ten? Cool. One full row. Oh dear. Sorry folks. I've just erupted the mountain and killed everybody. No. Nah. Nah, 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 nah. Look at that. Clear skies. Terribly textured skybox. Chamber of the Sages. Thank you, brother. I really appreciate what you did. I thank you on behalf of the entire Goron race. You turned out to be a real man, just as I thought you would. By the way, I, the wild Darunia, turned out to be the great sage of fire. Isn't that funny, brother? Well, this must be what they call destiny. Nothing has made me happier than helping you seal the evil here. Hey brother, take this. This is a medallion that contains the power of the fire spirits and my friendship. What a lad. What an absolute chad. He just loves his bros. Darunia awakens as a sage and adds his power to yours. Excellent. Don't forget, now you and I are true brothers. Brofist. Okay. What is next? Hmm. Well... I've got a hammer and there were some blocks up here I needed to smash. So let's go and smash those first of all. And then we can think about how to get to the next dungeon because I don't... I know it's the water dungeon, which is terrible, but... Hmm. I need to think about how we get there. Oh, hello. Sell me Deku Nuts. Um. Bombs? Okay. Ow. 
arrows. Okay. I'll take them. I didn't even look how much that was. Was that 70 rupees? Oh my lord. I just said yes. And the, the chumpiest of chumps when there's a pot right outside the door that will give you infinite arrows if you keep going in and out. Yeah, okay. Possibly a mistake. What's in here? Ah, the fairy's fountain. Uh, what do you do? The uh, Zelda's lullaby? I think that's the right one. Look at that. Sexy bitch. <laughs> Welcome, Link. I am the Great Fairy of Wisdom. I'm going to enhance your magic power. Receive it now. Oh, thank you. How kind. They really didn't spend any of the budget on making that model look good. <laughs> Everything else looks alright. She looks like she has just fallen out of a Super Nintendo. Your magic meter is enhanced. Now you have twice as much magic power. When battle has made you weary, please come back to see me. Will do. Off we just saying. Double magic. I do like the long magic bar. That looks good. Fine. Oh dear, is that something I can jump? Yes. Hmm. Oh, and that puts you at the top of Death Mountain. Okay. I know where I am. Let's just smash this rock. Real quickly. That was a fairy fountain. I don't need to go up there. That was a cow, I think. Something under there. Where do I need to go? Let's get outside, first of all. We can have a proper think. Ah. Hello. Hey, boss. My brother! Open a new store! It's Medigoron's Blade Store. However... I am better at making blades. Oh, shit. Skip text. I'm not lying, man. I'm not going to do the big Goron, so I don't need it. Oh, Jesus. That was a mistake. Just hurl myself off the mountain. Lake Hillier is the next step. Where are we? We're up here. Oh god. Hmm. Oh yeah. These guys come down. Are they Gorons or are they just rocks? just a rock. That's not a Goron. It's two of them. Anyway, we're going to Lake Hillier next. Har har, on your back. Oh, is there one more spider I can find somewhere? Because then I can cash in 30 at the uh, spider house. Hmm. 
Can you hook shot to that guy? There must be one spider around here somewhere. There must be. Hello. If I fall asleep up here, I'll surely fall in. Well, yeah, you probably will. No, that's too far. Okay. Worth a try. Let's see. Oh, it's rumbling. There's a secret. Oh. Oh no, I forgot. You don't look at these guys. Get off. Get off. Please. I beg you. Rupee worth 200. Oh, with my almost full wallet. Oh well. Another creepy location found. There must be one spider somewhere in this stupid town. Let's go and check the graveyard now. I've got a hook shot. Seems to recall there being one or two in there that I couldn't reach. Maybe not in here then. Whatever. And uh, waiting faithfully. Hmm. Where's the lake? It's the opposite side, it's that bottom left corner. Lake Hillier. Hey 
I planted a bean here as a kid. Let's go and ride it to its logical conclusion. You fucker. You've got a piece of heart. So far, you've collected two pieces. With two more, you'll gain life energy. Well, happy days. Oh. Yeah, let's keep doing that. Break knees. Break Ming's knees. Yellow. Hello there, son. I'm researching the process of making medicine. Barlick mixing. This is what he said as a, a child. He said nothing since in the last seven years he hasn't developed a new conversation oh, I can't quite make it to the bottom there must be a way to dive deep how do we get that I got it from the Zoras the first time around maybe they'll give it to me again it was through that little Oh, let's go and see the scarecrows quickly. We'll do that first. Hey, aren't you the fairy buddy uh, you met a long time ago? You grew, dude. Well, here's your song. What? No, I never forget. You're the one who forgot, aren't you? If you have an ocarina, play that song, baby. Terrible song. That's the tune you rock. I'm blown away. I didn't forget the song. I never forget anything. But I just feel like rewarding you, baby. Oh, skip the text. It'll tell him to help if he hears that song nearby. Okay, that's the other one, wasn't it? The one that said he wanted to explore the world. Play that song. Scarecrow appears. Hook shot onto the scarecrow. Got it. Let's go see the Zoras. Oh. Except that's a lot a blung a blump. A bl a block of ice. A blah 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 block of ice. Okay. Maybe I need to go to the Zoras up the river, first of all, rather than through the lake. That makes sense. Well, let's find the horse. Could go fishing. I don't want to go fishing. I did that as young Link and it was a bit boring. River is all the way up there. I never really thought about the logistics of it, but that river does cover literally the entire map. Like it's top right to bottom left. It doesn't make much sense. Oh, Poe. Hello. leave you here. Horses don't like water.
Hmm. There is a secret there, but I couldn't open that as a as kid link either, and I don't know how to open it here. Never mind. Let's take the Beanstalk Express. Oh Jesus. This is quick. There's a bit of heart back there I missed as well. I should I should at least investigate it. Like that. Oh no. I should have jumped off over there. Or maybe I still can. too far, that's why. Is that something when you have the uh, the hover boots later you can come back and do? I suppose I could maybe cheese it as I fly by, but that's I don't really have the energy for that. Zelda's Lullaby? Yep. Everything's frozen. Zora shop. We have fresh fish. Um, can I melt him with Din's fire? That's a no. Negative. frozen as well. Hey King, he's still blinking. What a poor man. He's literally frozen solid. Well, oh, this is the ice cavern. Oh, I forgot this existed. I forgot this existed. This being incredibly fiddly and annoying, and I hate it. Hmm. Oh, and there's a heart piece over there, so I've got to get that. I'm not just walking past the heart piece. Cool, that's three. One more, and we're, we're on the gravy train to 11 hearts. Oh, camera, don't do that. Oh, oh. There we go, that's not too bad. I remember this being quite difficult, or at least annoying. That's it. Overhead spikes, so they only do a quarter, so that's not the end of the world. I can get a lot of that. So we've got a spinner, we've got three of those, can I shoot them? No. Okay. 
Okay. Oh, and there's one that just warps about. Hello? Excuse me. There we go. Let's get in the center. Anything else around here? Some frozen rupees. And there's an exit up there. Press on. Ah. Oh, silver rupees. I haven't thought about those for a while. So, nice. There we go. And there's one hovering in the air. Okay. Let's grab you. frozen. Oh, I'm frozen. Move. Convenient. Three hearts. I should have explored down there first. Oh well. This blue fire, it doesn't seem natural. Maybe you can use it for something. Oh, you catch blue fire, don't you? In a bottle. I've got to let one of these boys go. Freedom. go. You put a blue fire into the bottle. This is a cool flame you can use with C. Dungeon map. I never thought of this as a full dungeon, really. I always thought of it as like a little mini dungeon. But I guess it does have a map. That does make sense. Okay, so. What options do I have? So I'm in there, so I've got to backtrack. So once I go through the corridor, that's probably that room with the big spinny spikes. There's two other ways out. 
like I've, I've got to investigate. Uh, I should probably just grab two fires. So I don't have to keep coming back and forward. I don't need three fairies. I'm not going to die three times in the uh, in the ice cavern. If I do, I deserve it. Should I take a third as well? No, fuck it. Two's fine, because if I need more than that, they'll, they'll give it to me. Oh, actually, let's melt this while I'm here. Just in case there's something semi-useful inside. Probably give me a fairy. He gave me a big rupee and then knocked me down. Amazing. Okay, so, a bit of backtracking. Oh, let's kill this dude as well. Oh, I wish he wouldn't do that. I wish he wouldn't do that. Fine, backtrack. I'm stuck. Slidey floors. Ah, that's my uh, wall to melt. Excellent. Exactly what I didn't want to do. And that's a little ramp out. What's on the opposite side? There's another one there as well. Hmm. well let's try this side first. Oh, it's one of these. Slidey puzzles with bats. I do hear a spider, which is good. I need. Oh! Let's get number 30. If I haven't already. the plan. I think we should start by going that direction. In that direction. Oh no! I didn't mean to do that, I'm meant to climb it. Shit. Okay, not to worry. Don't even need the platform for that one. Can't cheese it in any way? No. Okay. Well, what if... I just dump it off the edge and it should reset. Oh, there is no edge there. Okay. There's an edge there though. Bye. Get in the fucking hole. to do. 
Let's, uh... Scarecrow Man. No. That's just a looky-looky, there's something to do here. No. A bit of blue fire. Hmm. Can I not just shove it in the hole? Yeah. There we go. But this time we need to go across. So we need to go up first. Oh. That way. Then that way. Blue fire. And that's how you get that side up. Okay. And then I've got to throw it in the hole one last time. And figure out how to get it across that way. Hmm. No, that's not going to be it, is it? Unless we go across and down. Is that going to catch it? That is. That's, that's almost there. If I can. Please, sir. Oh, yep, thank you. Spare fire would come in handy. Look at this. Trippy walls. Hello. Ah, the iron boots. So heavy you can't run, so heavy you can't float. Shake. Shake it all about. <laughs> we meet again, Link. If you came here to meet the Zoras, you wasted your time. This is all there is. With one exception, the Zoras are now sealed under this thick ice sheet. I managed to rescue the Zora princess from under the ice, but she left to head for the water temple. This ice is created by an evil curse. The monster in the water temple is the source of the curse. Unless you shut off the source, this ice will never melt. If you have courage enough to confront the danger and save the Zoras, I will teach you the melody that leads to the temple. Time passes, people move, like a river's flow it never ends. A childish mind will turn to noble ambition, young love will become deep affection, 
the clear water surface reflects growth. Now listen to the serenade of water to reflect upon yourself. A, down, right, right, left. You've learned the serenade of water. I'll see you again. Ninja, f Ninja smoke. Ninja flashbang. Look at these trippy walls. What kind of room is this? Jesus. Okay. Um, let's test out those new iron boots, shall we? Straight to the bottom. You can't breathe underwater. Oh, right. I need the um, the diving suit. The blue suit. Okay. So what's left in here, then? If I look at my dungeon map, there was one room I didn't go to. I bet that had the... Uh, that's only through across the way. I could just go and check it out. Oh, I needed some fire to get through. Okay. I don't need fire to melt the king out as well, and I don't have any. Let's grab some fire before we we leave this dungeon. We'll melt that that last door out, and then we'll take one back to the king. That seems like the right thing to do. You fucking son of a bitch. That is not the right weapon to kill those things with. Um, here. Blue fire. You can buy blue fire in one of the shops, I'm sure, as well. I don't remember which one, but there was a shop that was selling blue fire. And so perhaps you don't have to come back in here over and over. Yeah. Let's just get out of here. Piece of heart. That was worth doing. That's another heart. On to the second row. I don't know why that's so satisfying, but it is. It's like incredibly satisfying. Um, let's equip a second bottle and then my arrows. 
We'll take as much blue fire with us as we can. Because I've got to defrost at least the shop door and the king, haven't I? No, I want my hook shot, not the arrows. Where are you? I hear you. I do not see you. Is this the compass? Should I have done this much earlier? Oh, I feel like I did things in vaguely the right order. Hmm, okay. How does the map look? That looks pretty finished to me. And I've got a gold spider, so I've got all the gold skull tellers. Let's get out of here. Fact, let's unequip. No, uh, let's leave it. I was going to unequip the blue flame so I don't accidentally use it, but I can't be bothered. I'll just be better. Um, this way, I think. Yeah. I'm going to defrost those. Not going to defrost that. Um, do I need to go in there? That's just the fairy fountain, isn't it? There's actually nothing to do in there. It's just the same fairy fountain I opened up as a as Kid Link. Unless it's changed. There's nothing more to do here, is there? Is there anything on the bottom? Some money. Let's dive down. Let's have a look. They wouldn't have just given those boots to me and then put this massive diverable area outside. Gotta be something down here. You get a whole minute and a half to explore. That's fine. Well, it's going to take me that long to get to the bottom. Heart piece. I knew it. Floaty float. Okay. Jeez, that is a real slow ascent. <laughs> Nope, that's the dive button. Hmm. Fine, let's go defrost the king of the fishies and his shop. Don't worry, boss. I've got you. I've got you back. Oh, I fell off the edge. Just do that. I did that. I knew I should have unbound it. I knew I should have unbound it. Well, maybe the shop won't be getting defrosted after all. 
Why can I not talk to him? Hello? Is there something else I need to do? Is there a particular... Oh, I just got to stand here. Okay. Oh, I've come back to life. <laughs> That's a great line. I love it. Was it you who saved me? Don't be nervous. It looks like you have a hard time breathing underwater. As an expression of my gratitude, I grant you this tunic. With this, you won't choke underwater. Ah. Adult size? Won't fit a kid. Wear it and you won't drown. Well, I am very annoyed that I accidentally wasted that fire. Maybe I can come back and fix it later. Okay, so we've got the blue tunic and we've got the iron boots. That seems like we're set to go into the temple, or at least start it. Can you unfreeze all this? I don't remember. Okay. Ah, they taught me that song as well. Can I warp? We'll have you, we'll have you, and we'll have you. And then the water song. What's that song? A down, right, right, left. That's the first time I've walked. Okay, so we want to get down. Yep. Boots. Now this is a, a, an annoying, fiddly dungeon. It's not even that difficult. There's just so many different levels and keys and... It's not a straight line like a lot of the other temples are. It's kind of back and forth a bit. Should be okay, as long as we're thorough. In each room, checking the map. Should be fine. It's when you start rushing and skipping things and not paying full attention. It gets a little more difficult. Oh, hello. It's got very good music, does the water temple. Okay. So top floor, we've got a door on the other side we can need to hook shot onto. We've got a key. We've got one of those. No. That's where I came in. And then the fourth side. Maybe there's something there. This is a bit annoying though, changing out your own boots all the time. Nothing. Nothing. Hmm, so that's a target to pull yourself through. And then I'll be able to. Oh, I see. So I push this block back. It doesn't go any further in, I take it. No. So I pull it back this way. And then eventually come around from that other angle to push it into the slot on the left there. That's an investment. That's, that's the next thing to happen. Alright. Up. 
Oh, the blue suit looks so fucking cool. I love it. That's the best look, I think, for Link in the game. He looks really good. Because the blue shield, the blue sword, it looks absolutely stellar. I guess we're going down, then. Down, 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 down. Baddies. Baddies. Oh. If I'm right, Link, you're Link, aren't you? It's me, your fiancé, Ruto, Princess of the Zoras. I never forget the vows we made to each other seven years ago. You're a terrible man to have kept me waiting for these seven long years. But now is not the time to talk about love. I'm sure you've already seen it. The Zoras domain, totally frozen. A young man named Sheik saved me from under the ice. But my father and the other Zoras have not yet I want to save them all. I want to save Zora's Domain. You have the power to help me. This is a request from me, the woman who is going to be your wife. Link, you have to help me destroy the evil monsters in the temple, okay? Inside the water temple, there are three places where you can change the water level. I'll lead the way. Follow me, quickly. Okay. I was going to explore all the other doors in this area, but if you're going up, then I don't really have a say in the matter, do I? Go in up. Yep, 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 yep. Oh, there's a bombable wall there. Oh, find the hole. Those who wish to open the path, sleeping at the bottom of the lake, must play the song passed down by the royal family. Let's check this room first. This is where she went. Okay, so that's nothing in this room. Nothing in this room. Okay. Let's deal with this. We're all family. Um, that lower it then. Can I land on that middle floor? No. Okay. Chair. This is very uncomfortable. Fine. Hmm. That's a bombable hole. Um, we'll get rid of the arrows.
probably. We want these, don't we? Oh my lord, it's coming for me. switch. Oh no, what's going up? Hook shot. Okay. I hear a spider. don't see any way of lifting that gate. Is there a switch? Let's jump in. Nauseating swinging the camera around like that. Okay. Let's. Oh, there's a switch inside. Bombsy-doos, some arrows. So is this just a treasure room then? There's no actual progression through here. It doesn't look like it. The map says it's a dead end. And this looks pretty clear to me. That's the thing with this dungeon. You never know. Because you do backtrack through some areas. So you have to be so thorough. I did this room, didn't I? This is where I found Ruto. Let's just double check. Yeah, that's done. Oh, or is it done? I've just seen there's two unlit torches in the corners. This is the sort of thing you've got to be careful about. It's so easy to miss. Can you imagine walking around this place for hours because you didn't notice those two torches? It's a killer. Okay, so 
So we've done that room. We've done that room. We've got whatever this is. Is this a push or a pull? It's a push. Well, let's set it up. I bet this is like the other one where it's a, a double approach. Push from one side. Ooh. Pull from the other? No? Okay. I've got a activate the water and then use it to hop across. Yeah. platform leading to the door there. Doesn't seem to be anything else. Oh, there's, a, there's an entrance up there. Maybe that's a way back in though after I've finished. That's your, your exit. Oh and there's a current as well. Should be obvious. So I want to try and land on there I suppose. There we go. And then we're going to hook shot our way through. And then what? Hmm. Shell blade. Hmm. Let's have a look about. What else is there to do? There's a switch in his mouth. I didn't see that. Can I walk up here? No, I can't. So I want to... that. Pop that. I want to at least... Can I get inside? Take my boots off. Float up. Bye. I'm sure I won't regret that decision. Because <laughs> I have to come back through there immediately. Key number two. Okay. Now we're making progress. Is that the same gate? Yes, it is. Okay. Fine. So, okay, maybe we don't need to go in there just yet. We can push on. Almost and upwards. Um, is that why that enemy is there? To give you an arrow if you run out completely. Oh, 
How do we get out? Oh, you've got a hook shot onto that target. You can't just walk out. Of course you can't. That'd be too easy. Chin up with the iron boots on. Well done, Link. Core strength. And we've done that side as well. Why have we not? Well, we did the one next to it. Did we actually do this side? I don't think we did. Let's find out. It's too far. Almost as though we need some sort of longer shot. That's all the ground floor stuff done. We've got two keys. One to get in the central pillar. So you can go out when the water level is low. Oh my lord. Camera, relax. I hear you. I don't see you. That's too far away. Let's raise the water. Platform goes up. There was a little hole under that. Um, where do we want to be? In the middle. It was there, wasn't it? Yeah. Line of spikes. So I hit the switch and all the baddies come come I run them. I'll kill them before I do anything else. kill him anyway. Okay. Arrows. Anything up here? No, that's just a monster hole. Very important. Still haven't got a compass. Okay. So now we can either explore the lower levels with the water a bit higher, 
I don't know what value there is to that. Or push on through the mid level. Or I could lower the water level and explore the mid level. You've got options. I won't complicate things. Let's just push on round and see what we see. And then, if needs be, we can return to adjust the water. What do we have? Key door? We have... Um, Arador? Need the long longbow for that. Long shot, sorry. This looks like one I can get to. Couple of hearts. Compass. It's not really a puzzle, is it? Now you can see where the fuck you're going in the water temple. Thank goodness. Hearts, hearts, hearts. Okay. Yep. Fine, that's helpful. Let's stop and take a look at this map. So on this floor, there's still two chests together. Okay. How do we do on the ground floor? Very bottom floor, there's still stuff to do. Stuff and stuff. God, that's such a, a daunting map. Well, this seems like the good choice next. As soon as I have two keys. Oh, it's going to land on my head, isn't it? I knew it. I fucking knew it. I could hear it. Back up here. Bye. But the water is mid level. Oh, I could raise it. Oh, shit. So that bottom door with the red block in front is how you get around to raise the, the water back to the top. And I should have just done that and gone through that door there. Okay. Okay. Well, let's do it. Not today, fucker. Okay, maybe today. Sort of today. Lullaby. Yeah. 
So that's the water back at its highest level. And I have a key for this door now. Him. I need the long shot. I also need a key. Gah. Fuck. Anything I can do from here? No. Okay. So, this perhaps isn't the way to go. Because I won't be able to open that door anyway. Let's see what else we can do. Can't reach over there, it's too far. do is raise and lower the water. So there must be an area where the level of the water is going to help me clear the room. Let's check the map. So the west side is where I want to go. Because it looks like the west side of this floor, if I go through there, can lead me through to a chest. Right, but that's that room there. Okay. So if I can find another key, this is where to come next. Okay. West side of the third floor. North side is the boss, so I can ignore the third floor for now. We can go down a floor. And try and go in through the west side as well, directly below me. Oh, but I can't get through the door at the moment. Fine. But there's still two chests I haven't got on that floor, and I've been in the rooms. Hmm. So if I go down to the ground floor, the north side's still got some stuff for me. And the west side's still got some stuff for me. Let's try that. Um, iron boots. Yeah, west and north. Okay. Didn't one of these areas? Well, I, I couldn't get through. That's that's a long shot. So the north side is off limits. So the west side. One of them had a, an area that had a bombable wall on the mid floor. So I need to bring the water up to the mid floor and then sink back down to the bottom. Hmm. 
There we go. And that's got a small key in it. That's my progression. So we're going to drop it. Head out again. There we go, in inside the pillar. Raise it. And the mid level should be fine. Top level or flood it, mid level should stop and allow me to plant the bomb on the platform. So we've just got to head outside, boots on, and then drop down into the room with the um, the unlit torches outside. There we go. Right, so now we're going back to... Was it top level? The west door? Yeah, it was the top level, the one that was open with a small key, so with a little red box outside to hop on. Saved. But we're currently on mid-level water, so I need to raise it up again. And it was the small key door on this floor that did that. Cheers. That one. This door, I think. Oh, this one goes down as well. Okay.
We need to run. Let's just get rid of those real quick. Okay. Okay. We're gaming. Magic. What's that for? Oh yeah, this guy. Stand on my sword. He did. Dark Link, conquer yourself. Okay. What other weapons we got? Fire? Wait, they gave me magic. He doesn't seem to like that. Fucking casual. Suck it. Beat yourself in the face with a hammer. Oh, I like that effect. I like the illusion falling away. What do I get? Big chest. Long shot? I think it's the long shot. Yeah, there we go. Long shot. Twice as far. 
Oh, it just sits on the same slot. Don't even have to equip it. Okay. Well, let's um, move this. careful. Don't get swallowed by the vortexes. Link's always trying to get swallowed. Hearts? Oh no, that was bait. That was bait. Oh no, you can... to do that. There we go. How are we doing with those now? 34. We can sneak past just... Hmm. Are they going to let you... Oh no, we want to swim. Hope I haven't balls that up. No. Nope. Yep. Yep. That is not the button to press. Oh no, Link's getting swallowed. Ooh. Nice mouth for the Link. Alright. The swim button. B is swim. Okay. Is there a better way through this? Am I supposed to be hook shotting my way through this or something? I don't know. Like that, that's what you're supposed to do. Grab it. There you go. Well done. Good job, Linky Poos. I'll take that fairy. And then immediately unequip it. So we're shooting that. And then try to get through that, I assume. Oh. It's a tight window to get through there. Okay. Ah, and this is that bit I said we'd we'd find later. And we did. So, what's the plan? We now have a long shot. Oh, I don't even need to do that anymore. We just ignore all the mechanics and zip about. Pardon me? Did you forget something, Link? Oh, it's because the water's high. I forgive you. I take it all back, Link. Let's check that map. What does the map say? So, this floor, the north side, has a bunch of stuff to do. 
The basement has a bit of stuff to do. And then the boss is at the top floor. Well, let's go to the basement. Oh, we are in the basement. Okay. No, we're not in the basement. We're at ground floor. How do you get to the basement? Now I've got a long shot. Hmm. Oh, is that where the platform rises in the middle and then you have to sink down? Okay. So we'll drop it. That's this one. Hold on, let's just think about this. Yes, yeah, the north side. This side. Can I do it with the water at this level? Is it reliant on the water being at a particular level? Or can I just do it? Do it. Oh, that's a that's a busy room. Can I just get funky with my my bow? get across. How are we doing this then? So there's a current it looks like and a vortex at each end so I can't just swim there. I gotta trek my way across. Probably take the boots off and then try and catch the ledge like that. Did I miss anything? I don't think I did. I can't see it. If I can't see it, it doesn't exist. Oh, hello. Stingers. I remember you. What have we got? A room over there. A bunch of stingers and some platforms. scared me. Ah, that's bombable. Or can I hit it with a hammer? I don't like using resources if I don't have to. No, bombs, okay. Ah, is this that bit on that very first little room I went into, where I pushed it one, di one direction. Now I can shove it another. You climb it? No. You can push it back, but that's as far as it goes. Okay. bomb de doms Is there something in the water? Hmm.
To here, it's no good. Is there a point to hook shot to? Oh, don't do that. in the middle, roughly. Hit your switch. Let the water go above the block. Because you're not trying to get all the way to the top, you're just trying to get on top of that block and then you can jump up from there. Oh, we must be getting near the end. This dungeon just goes on. What does this even do? Opens that. Okay, we'll do this in two goes. Because I will get knocked off. 100%. I will shoot you. And I will shoot you. Floor. That looks like the way to go. There we go. Shit. I'm one small key short. Where's that then? Have I missed a key or a room? Ah, there's a chest in the room I was just in. Okay. And a chest there on the second floor. Let's work our way back. How annoying. This is why I hate this dungeon. Shit like this. So this large room has a couple of rooms off the side. Again. 
there anything down here? Oh, I'm on the basement floor now. Okay, so there's nothing. Right. Um... that side so okay and that must be the boss key that must be which means that's the chest I haven't got so I need to go back to the main room get to the middle floor and take the south entrance can I go back through here Or is it quicker to literally go the other way? Oh, whatever, I'm here now. Yeah, this is literally where I was a second ago. Okay. What happens if I jump in a hole? Do I respawn here? Or do I respawn on the other side? I respawn here. That is no use to me. Go! Go, 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 Please. Yep, yep, yep. Where was I going? Not that floor. We were going up to the mid floor. And the water is currently all the way at the top, so I need to drop it. And which side was it? Sorry? South side. Ah, that one there. Now I've got the long shot I can bolt through, can't I? Okay, we have a plan. We're not lost yet. We just took a, a slight mis mis turn. Is this the right way? Mm, I'm not sure it is. I think I've gone the wrong way. Oh. This dungeon, my boy. Fucking terrible. There we go. That's what I'm looking for. 
No, nope, wrong button. So we want the water on the mid level. Or do we? Does it matter? If, I suppose it does because that's how you get out, isn't it? Oh my lord, camera. Please. Can I just go? Yeah, I guess that's fine. Don't need the water here. It going? I hope I don't. Um, I'll cut that bit out. <laughs> no one will see it. pushed earlier. Now we push it this way. And that gets us the last small key. Finally. Couple of hearts. Can we hook shot out this way? What's the plan? Map says Ground floor, north entrance. So that way. the block in place? No, it is not. That's... Unlock, please.
right through my fucking hearts. Need it there. Boss key, finally. Do I need a third fairy? Need's probably the wrong word, but I'll, I'll take it. If it ever shows its face again. There it is. Has this got a fairy? Yeah. That couldn't be more ideal. So now, all we've got to do is head back to the main room, put the water up to the top floor, and then hook shot over and boss time. Can't wait. I like the boss in this dungeon. Pretty cool. So we need to get the water to the top level, which I think is done through here. No, that's that's the bottom level. We've got to go up the tower, take it to the middle. going out and then we're going to the door with a red floaty box outside which would be this one that one oh no I shouldn't have done that I've got to activate this boy
Kill him? Now we can get across to there. Game. Don't do that to me, please. Apple pots. More fairies. Come here. And another one for good luck. Let's do it. This is a save. Oh, you've got the middle. Can't even cheat it. Uh, uh, no. Oh, I thought that was a clomp up the middle through sheer weight kind of thing. Maybe not. Maybe I'm mistaken. Boss time. Hmm. Look out. That isn't normal water over there. Where? There we go. I like how you have to trigger the boss fights. You just have to look at something or jump on something. It doesn't just happen. Creepy. I love it. I love it. Good boss. The thing. It's just this amorphous blob. Giant aquatic amoeba. Morpha. Tell you what, let's not fight in the middle. Oh my god, what's he doing? I'm getting choked. There's a bunch of damage. Half dead. Gonna run away. Any hearts or anything? Oh, that's when you get it, when it's like that. So we'll let it build up. You back off. So it ain't going to reach. And then it does that. Charge that hook shot. Wait for him to come up. Oh. 
Oh, too close, too close, too close. Oh, and there's multiple of them there as well. So we're going to avoid that guy. As Nevi say. Pull out the nucleus and attack it. Got it, okay. Oh no. This is going to get me. Lucky I had three fairies. I hope it didn't get me. Still haven't died. I didn't think I was close enough for that. Come on, just kill me. Get it over with. Whee! Oh, is it easier to fight in the water? I hadn't even thought of that. Let's throw some boots on. They wouldn't have given me these boot lovely booties if they weren't useful. Except I can't attack in the water. No, they're no use at all. Right, okay. Abandoned ship. Up the ladder. Don't let the far one get me. Get nice and far back. I take so many hits. Six, seven hits so far. Oh, I wasn't even looking. I was watching the amoeba. Okay, it's fine. One there. Free hit. Maybe that's how you're supposed to do it. One there, one there. Okay, back up, back up, back up, back up, back up. Prime the hook shot. Sure. That's a cool boss fight. I like that. A bit fiddly. Pretty good. And he's all dried up. The amoeba, there's no more. Where's my heart? in here somewhere. Other side. That's 12.
Link. I would have expected no less from the man I chose to be my husband. Zora's domain and its people will eventually return to their original state. As a reward, I grant my eternal love to you. Well, that's what I want to say, but I don't think I can offer that now. I have to guard the water temple as the sage of water. And you? You're searching for the Princess Zelda? Ha! <laughs> you can't hide anything from me. Princess Zelda. She's alive. I can sense it, so don't be discouraged. I can tell that nothing will stop you in your quest for justice and peace. You must take this medallion. Take it respectfully. I'm, I'm looking respectfully. You receive the Water Medallion. Ruto awakens as a sage and adds her power to yours. Good stuff. If you see Sheik, please give him my thanks. Okay. As the water rises, the evil is vanishing from the lake. Link, you did it! Did Ruto want to thank me? I see. We have to return peace to Hyrule for her sake too, don't we? Look at that, Link. Together, you and Princess Ruto destroyed the evil monster. Once again, the lake is filled with pure water. All is as it was here. Where'd you go? Hiding up a tree. Don't look up, Link. When the water fills the lake, shoot for the morning light. go. I knew it was something like that. Ah, magic arrows. Right, we've been going for almost five hours. I think it's almost time to give this a rest. Find a good spot and finish. Fire arrow. Set it to C and your arrows are powered up. If you hit your target, it'll catch fire. Hmm. Um, what do we want to do next? I wanted to go and do that diving game in Zora's Domain. What's that? Oh, that's the thing I knocked off of the front. Okay. Swim, swim, swim. Maybe go fishing as well? Oh no, it's still... F it's still frozen, isn't it? Hmm. So maybe you can't do the diving game as an adult. I thought it would unfreeze. Well, in that case... What's the next thing to do? Hmm. 
Let's go to Kakariko Village. I can cash in all of these um, skull tellers I found. So I've got quite a few now. Um, I need a horse. <clears throat> Where are you, faithful horsey? Stereo sound is failing me. There we go. There we go. Tiny, unnoticeable ledge. Oh, pick it up, my boner. Can't fuck about now. There we go. Kakariko Village. Oh, Jesus. That house is burning. Just got absolutely murked. <laughs> Ghosties coming out of the well. Oh, Jesus. Things are getting fucked up. Looks like you're coming round. Link, a terrible thing has happened. The evil shadow spirit has been released. Impa, the leader of Kakariko Village, had sealed the evil shadow spirit in the bottom of the well. But the force of the evil spirit got so strong, the seal of the well broke, and he'd escaped into the world. I believe Impa has gone to the Shadow Temple to seal it again but she will be in danger without any help. Link, Impa is one of the six sages. Destroy the evil shadow spirit and save Impa. There is an entrance to the shadow temple beneath the graveyard behind this village. The only thing I can do for you is teach you the melody that will lead you to the shadow temple. This is the melody that will draw you into the infinite darkness that absorbs even time. Listen to this nocturne of shadow. It's complicated. Left, right, right. A left, right, down. It's a good start. There we go.
you have learned the Nocturne of Shadow. Let me take care of the village. I'm counting on you, Link. Okay. Kapsh. Deku Nut Ninja Smoke. Alright. Let's cash in these dudes. Ah, that's the one I'm looking for. You. The curse has been broken. Thank you. Here's a reward. Giant's wallet. You can carry up to 500 rupees. That's what I like. No more wasted rupees as I run around. So. What's the deal? Hmm. Oh, I have a long shot. I can get up to see that guy now. Let's go and talk to him. Can I just hook over from here? Oh. Hello. Hey, good to see you again. I'll give you this as a memento. That's two. Okay. They did say go to the graveyard. That seems... Oh no, they didn't say jump straight down the well. That's, um... That's not right. That's sealed. Let's go to the graveyard, see if we can find a nice, um, tidy place to log off. And we'll wrap it up for the day. Maybe I can get up here with a long shot now. Like, can I see the top of that? Hmm. That is annoying. Try and gain a pixel. That's all I need. There we go. Why do I want to be up here? Oh, huh. Oh. That's three. So there's one more somewhere. Let's get me to 13. What does that say? The Crest of the Royal Family is inscribed here. Family's tomb. Shine light on the living dead. Kind of like the 
these torches. Is there something to bomb? Those who break into the royal tomb will be obstructed by the lurkers in the dark. Okay. I'm prepared. I'm prepared to just run past you. Unless I need to kill you, in which case I'll come back. This poem is dedicated to the memory of the dearly departed members of the royal family. The rising sun will eventually set, a newborn's life will fade. From sun to moon, moon to sun, give peacefully, peaceful rest to the living dead. This is an interesting poem, huh? Something is inscribed on the tombstone. It's the secret melody of the Composer Brothers. Oh, didn't I kill them earlier? <laughs> right down up, right down up. You've learned the sun's song. Made it all sunny. Cool. Restless souls wander where they don't belong. Bring them calm with the sun's song. You have anything else to say, Skullboy? No? Uh. No. No. Okay, what are we doing? So it just lets you get a, a good free hit on them. Okay, so, what's the plan? She said the Shadow Temple behind the graveyard is back here, isn't it? Did I need to go in the graveyard? I didn't see a way into any... Oh, there is a... There is a ledge up there. How does one get up there, though? Is that a hook shot? Can I just... No. Can I warp there? I did get the uh, song. Left, right, right, A. Left, right, down.
Yeah, that's how you do it. That's probably not how you do it. Fine, let's uh, go on in. Oh, look at these torches. Look at these torches. I've never seen anything so ready for this. Awesome. Very satisfying. Shadow Temple. Fine, I think this is a good place to turn off and come back. We'll try and do it tomorrow afternoon. Finish off the uh, Shadow in the last temple. See if we can't beat the game. I want to get ready for Majora's Mask in, in February. That'd be a good one to play. Right, thank you very much. See you tomorrow. Bye.